on. I'm chilling, baby. Getting it in. Coming to show love, support. You already know. I like your glasses, first of all. I got similar glasses. I love glasses. But, um, <laughs> but I mean, so life after making the band. How has it been? That's the name of my TV show, too, Life After the Band. But um, I, I, I should be your co-producer. We should talk about that. See how, how instinctive I am about shit like that? But I didn't even know that. Did you, did, did you post that somewhere or something? No, but that is the name of it. <laughs> oh, okay. We're doing the treatment for the show right now, actually. Where, where is the show going to be aired? We trying to get it on VH1 or MTV. Okay, so the show's going to be just about you? It's going to be a reality show or what? About life after the band, about me making the album, the album coming out, and just what I've been doing after the band. Okay, so are you, are you still officially signed to Bad Boy? or Official. Bad Boy is the label, always willing and able. Okay, so, I mean, so what's going on with you and Foxy? Like, you guys have, like, officially joined forces? Like, you guys are, like... You know, somebody somebody starts with Foxy and she says Bass get her and Bass gets her. Like, what's going, what's going on with that? She don't say Bass get her, but if I'm there, you know it's going down anyway. But that's my people. That's that BK swagger, that love right there. So we just fuck with each other like that. So you stay in the East, don't you? you stay in East yeah, New, York. New York. You look like you look like right around the corner from me, dog. What? Like I think I know your uncle. Like Nate, I think his name is. Yeah. Shout out to Nate. <laughs> you think this AD the general? You was telling me she was your niece and all that, and you was like, General, my niece raps. You need to get it in with her before the making the band, but he never gave me the number back. It's all good. You got me now. Know what I mean? So when you made the show, he was like, I told you, that's my niece. And, and he was very, really excited. Um, so life after making the band. You working on an album? Working on an album. Should be released the end of this year or early next year. And I'm dropping mixtapes like crazy. I just shot a video for the hood. About to put that out on, all on the internet in about a week. So, Well, can, can I get the video to air on Nan TV? Definitely. Yeah. Before everybody else will do that. Maybe not. Before everybody I'm pushing else. it. I'm pushing it. I'm pushing it. I'm pushing it. Else. Can I get an exclusive vote? Oh? Do, do you have any tracks, any exclusive tracks I can play on my radio show? Man Radio, every Sunday, 6 to 8 p.m. Shout out to my DJ, DJ Spence. He's 20 years old, getting it in. It's his first time on the air without me. You better have not fucked up my broadcast today. <laughs> I'm having so much fun. So, Baps, so now you have, you have a mixtape after mixtape. You have uh, the album coming out. Do you have the reality show? Is there anything else that you're trying to do in the music business? I'm just trying to get all the females together so we could just do our thing. That's it. I'm starting an all-female movement called The Squad, and I'm looking for chicks that's about their money, about their business. You could rap, sing, dance, whatever. If you're about getting paid and you're about handling your business, then let's get it in. You know what? We have a lot in common, Bass. You know, I just, I just it's crazy because, you know, I got an all-female movement, too, and it's called Nothing Ass Bitches. Shout out to the Nothing Ass Bitches, you know, and the, just the, in general, let me explain something to you. Uh, nothing Ass Niggas, we live on the concept of nothing, meaning that everything we want to achieve in life is nothing to achieve. But at the same time, Baps, you know, me being born in East New York, you know, we were born with nothing and we're going to die with nothing. So that's the whole concept of the Nothing Ass Niggas, Nothing Ass Bitches, so forth and so forth. But I really like the whole concept of women helping women. Mm -hmm. So do, do you have any members already that you want to shout out? Yeah, shout out to Tania the Angel, Von the Jewels, and Lay Stones. You already know how it's going down. We about to tear it up on the 28th too, so. Wait, 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 where you going to go? At the Pyramid, we about to, you know, I'm bringing my girls out for the little showcase and let everybody see how I'm doing it. So are, are you uh, ho hosting or judging? I'm the feature act. I need to talk to her and get her as a feature act in my showcase in Brooklyn. We do it in the hood, though. You come to the hood and party with us? Always in the hood. I party in the hood all the time. You got to holler at me. We got to holler, dog. We stop. Right, stop. Right. I am so glad I met you, dog. You know, I used to watch the show back when I used to smoke. I don't do that anymore. Yeah, I thought you was going to put it in the air. No, nah, but we could. Oh, all, oh, right. all right, all right, all right. He do. But I drink, though. You drink? Not really. You don't drink? Not really. I smoke. Yo, I'm, I'm saying bats, bats, bats. I own yeah. the bar at the club. I might drink when I'm with you then. Yeah, I, I might, I might pop a bottle of more or whatever. I yeah. um, me, I ate the general. You know, I'm trying. I'm trying to work in maybe a song collab or with some shit. You know, and all that. But 
Anything else that you might want to say to uh, the audience? And this is called Nothing Ass Nigga Television. So if you have anything in particular that you want to say to anybody in the world, what would it be right now? Stop hating. And don't be scared, bitches, because I'm coming. If you ain't going to show love, then you already know what's going to happen. Bottom line. We back. I am so exhausted. First of all, I took off my uh, nice little shawl where everybody thought I was Jewish. I tried to comb my hair downstairs. It was terribly frizzed out and stuff, so I put it back in a ponytail. Um, I took the shoes off outside officially. I got the chancletas on. I'm down with the homie Jay-Z in all of Brooklyn right now wearing my chancletas with my socks. Um, it was crazy in there. Um, in fact, I really never really got to really mingle outside because the backstage alone at the Underground Music Awards is crazy. I just have a few things to say to Jesse and Mars. First of all, I would like to thank you guys for inviting me on TV and of course the Brother Sister Network Video City, April G and Carte. But let's get some things straight. We need press passes when we come in here so that security won't harass us every 20, 30 seconds. You need to get the hell out of here because we have yellow bands. We waited out there three hours. We were totally unrespected. When Video City, Nan TV, Rap Fanatic Magazine, Playgirl, Soul Fire Records, all of us work very... You understand what I'm saying? We work... Listen. Next time we come, 2008, that's if we come, and if you still want us and love us and appreciate us, just show us some love, little press passes, we feel special, maybe some water in the back, you dig what I'm saying? But overall, besides the, the crazy stuff out here, maybe it needs to be reorganized, or whatever, whatever, you dig, maybe you'll hate me after this, but it does. The artists don't, don't, don't need to be standing out here, um, but I'm sure you had a lot of stuff going on, so it is what it is, I respect the movement. Underground Music Awards, Ma Barker, incredible, Baps, incredible, Molly Marr, incredible, Chuck Dog, incredible, everybody was incredible. You dig what I'm saying? Kev Lawrence, Vlad the Butcher, stop fronting. I'm coming for you. We out, Nan TV.